Customers at the Lock Supply Company in Yukon got an unusual <laughs> greeting. This pot-bellied pig nipping at their heels. A customer got that picture of the pig trying to sneak in behind a customer. Oh, yeah. And KSTO's Patty Santos tells us how this friendly potbelly pig was able to find her way home. It's new at 10. Yukon Animal Shelter is used to rescuing dogs and cats, but today they rescued something a little more unusual. Calls about dogs and cats are very common to us, but I think this is our first pig. <laughs> this is what happens when a pig tries to walk into a Yukon store, huffing and puffing, fighting to get inside. Yeah, it was trying to nip at people in lock supply. <laughs> was it inside the store? Uh, yeah, it followed a customer inside the store. This is the first time in 16 years Yukon Animal Control Officer Terry Wangsgard gets set on a pig call. That's him and three other men corralling the four legged escapee. With no tag or microchip, they turned to social media for help. About an hour later, <laughs> there were lots of squeals as Adriana, Curtis, and Bailey showed up to claim their pot belly pig. What's your pig's name? Daisy. This is the second time this week Daisy leads the kids on a hot pursuit. So she intends to run away now. Yes. Yeah. What are you going to do to make sure she doesn't run away anymore? I, I think no we're idea. going to keep her in the house for now on. Carrot treats and familiar faces. Little Daisy went wee, wee, wee all the way home. In Yukon, Patty Santos, KOCO 5 News.